live with the details. Good morning. Good morning. How's your day going? Wonderful. Okay, so what, what, what gave you the idea to do something like this? I'm sorry, I didn't quite catch the first part of that. What gave you the idea to do something like this? Well, KT, who is the organizer for the Women's Empowerment Center, came in and we started talking. And Bishops is really big on being part of the community and being supportive. And so we decided to team up and it seemed like the perfect opportunity for us to get involved. And now how long are you guys going to be doing this? Because it's only a certain amount of time where people can come in. If they get a haircut, you're going to donate a haircut to this women's empowerment. Exactly. So we'll be doing it from now until the 14th. What stands out about the particular nonprofit women's empowerment to you, to your group? Uh, I mean, for me particularly, the Women's Empowerment Center is definitely something that is important for our community. Um, it's not just providing services and supporting them, it's teaching them how to be supportive to themselves and how to create better habits and life skills. And one of the things Bishops prides itself on is being inclusive to the entire community. Everybody is welcome in there to come and get their hair done. What are some of the uh, styles that you guys are working on right now? Well, right now um, in the first chair, I'm doing some balayage with like a nice bright red root color. Um, Kyle's working on some texture and kind of getting some movement into the hair. And then Elisha is doing some beautiful curls on this wonderful hair. Yeah, beautiful. And we do, I mean, right now we have primarily women's hair in here, but we also do shortcuts and everything in between. Okay, located downtown 17th and R Street. Yeah, in the ice in the ice box area. Oh yeah, that's right. Yeah. Right next to Pete's Coffee, so you can get a coffee and then go get your hair done. Cam